on May 30th, 2020 at 3.22 p.m. Eastern Time. The United States will make history once again. Elon Musk and SpaceX, in partnership with NASA, will return astronauts to orbit from the United States for the first time since the space shuttles ended in 2011. This is the first crewed test flight of the Crew Dragon 2, and it will carry two astronauts, Doug Hurley and Bob Bacon, to the International Space Station as part of the agency's commercial crew program. This mission will be the return of human spaceflight launch capabilities from the United States on the first launch of an American rocket and spacecraft. Good luck and Godspeed. We're all counting on you. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Certainly when you go through the, the launch day preparations, there's a lot of moments that kind of stand out to you. When the engine's light, you know you are going and you know you're going somewhere pretty fast. When the engine shut off, you go from three Gs to zero Gs instantaneously and things start floating. And, and I remember distinctly just thinking, what just happened? Same thing happens when you get to space station. It's kind of a defining moment when you get the hatches back open. By sharing this experience uh, with SpaceX and creating another partner that has the same capability, I think we really set the future up to continue to blossom. This will be the first time humans have ridden on the Falcon 9, even though it's flown many, many times. And so just taking in that experience and, and the sounds and all those things that we can relate to future crews is gonna be something important to do too. Oh, 
Falcon 9 is in startup. Dragon is in countdown. FTS is armed for launch. Bands have been deployed. Dragon, SpaceX, go for launch. T minus 30 seconds. Stage one tanks pressing for flight. T minus 15 seconds. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, Falcon 9 is in start. Dragon is in count. Two, one, zero. Ignition. FTS. Under a minute now, FTS. My termination system has been warned. Dragon, SpaceX, go for launch. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Falcon stage separation confirmed. And back ignition. Acquisition of signal works. Alright, we should have uh, first stage separation here in about another 30 seconds. SpaceX nominal trajectory. Acquisition of signal Bermuda. Okay. 
There's the boom. There's separation. Stage two propulsion is still nominal. Dragon SpaceX nominal trajectory. We've got separation and the first stage boost will be landing off the coast of South Carolina. That's where the PSLW drone ship is actually stationed right now. That's where the booster is going to come down. Dragon Space and that is where it will land on the ship. As you can see though, there was a lot of people come out for the launch all along the beach here by Kennedy Space Center. And I don't think there wasn't hardly anybody that didn't have a tear in their eye and was jumping for joy the entire time. So until next time, thanks for watching. And make sure you like and subscribe here to Strickland Photography.